tools. Tell me about the recognizer you built. All right, so we have a touchpad here, which is intended to recognize your handwriting. And uh, the way it works is that as you draw, samples are being collected by the ADC on the microcontroller. And it's saved to a, a matrix where the pixels are held. And I'll show you an example of that. So when the light's green, the pixels are, or the samples are being taken. And when the light's red, it's analyzing. So if I draw an A, it's analyzing, collected an A, and then printed out an A on there. Okay. So the way this works is that in the beginning, we first collected data, and we had a program which sent full alphabets to MATLAB. And we got lots of different people to draw their alphabets for us. And then in MATLAB, we used that data to train a neural network. Um, the neural network, in the end, is just a set of weights which can quickly classify an input example. And so once we got the neural network, we uploaded it onto the flash chip, which is kind of hidden right back here. So there's a so there's a flash RAM, 32 megabit, 32 uh, megabit flash SPM RAM flash, yeah. underneath. And the reason yeah. why that was necessary was because the neural network weights uh, total up to about 88 kilobytes for us, and that's more memory than the rest of the chip has at all. So, uh, yeah. So then when you draw it. It has to actually pre-process the input that you take because it's kind of messy. There's a lot of noise on the ADC sometimes. And so what it has to do is remove small uh, chunks that, that were mistakes, basically. Can we get them to stop talking? Sure. Stop talking, please. Hey, guys. So, um, so yeah, it pre-processes the input a little bit and removes, removes the noise and then normalizes it so that it fills a 15 by 12 box. And once you do that, the neural network expects 180 pixels, 15 by 12, as input. And so uh, you can easily run the neural network on it by downloading the, the weights from Flash and finally classify it and print it out. Okay. So do you want to talk about some of the other small functionalities that we have? Um, yeah, so once you, you know, once you print it out, we have basic you know, formatting tools. We have backspace, space, and clear on just some quality of life um, things there. Um, yeah. Uh, Should I do it? I guess Basically, that's yeah. it. Let's uh, show an example of it working, yeah, sure. I guess. So do hit the clear then. Right, so so this clear. is totally generalized, and even if you're not part of the training set, it will recognize your handwriting. Right. Yeah, it worked for me earlier. Right, exactly. <laughs> yeah, all right. So, so write something, write Cornell okay. on there. So we're recognizing letters with a little bit over 90% accuracy, and almost... You know, even if we screw up, uh, usually within three tries, um, at the very most, uh, you'll get the right letter. So that time was perfect. Perfect. Okay. Very good.